Optifine is available for Minecraft 1.20, 1.1, and in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to download and install this Optifine. Now, keep in mind that the Optifine that we're about to install is a still a snapshot of the original Optifine, so it's not the official release yet, but it's just a snapshot. It's kind of a beta, okay? Let's go ahead and get started. Now, step number one is to click the second link in the description, which is gonna be this page in here where you're gonna get the snapshot by Optikai. Again, guys, it's just a snapshot. This is not the official Optifine, and as soon as the official Optifine is released, we'll have a video here on the channel. Anyways, over here, select the 1.21.1 .1 and click on Mirror, and that is going to bring over here where we're going to click download right away and then as you can see the download will begin and while the file is downloading i want you to read over here where it says install java 21 and i want you to remember that information because that is going to be important in the future anyways as of now let's go ahead and drag and drop that optifine file that we just downloaded into our desktop which as you can see i already went ahead and did you could always find your downloads here on your recent download history or within your downloads folder within your pc with this file on the desktop the next step is to make sure that our minecraft game as well as the minecraft launcher is completely closed but not before we have played minecraft 1.20 1.1 at least once in our computer now we could go ahead and install the optifine or the preview of optifine 1.20 1.1 right click on the file and then click open with and select java and this is where I said that you need to remember that a step. You need to have Java 21 to open the installer. If you don't have Java 21 in your computer, this won't open, okay? Anyways, those of you that were able to open it, go ahead and hit install. And if you weren't able to open it, make sure you click on that third link in the description, which is our written guide on how to download and install Java 21. Again, this is a requirement. Any Minecraft app of Minecraft 1.20.5 would require you to have Java 21, in fact, to use any mod. Anyways, when you try to install this, it's gonna give you this little warning here, letting you know that this is just a snapshot built. It's not the official Optifine yet. Just go ahead and click OK. And now let's go ahead and hit install one more time to make sure that the installation does happen. As you can see, Optifine is successfully installed. Go ahead and hit OK. And now you could go ahead and even delete the installer file of Optifine. Once the Minecraft launcher open, if you install Optifine properly, it should be selected here automatically. As you can see, Optifine is snapshot. If not, just head over to installation and make sure that modded is selected. If it doesn't come up after you select modded, you could just click on new installation and find Optifine snapshot in there and add it manually, okay? Anyways, let's go ahead and launch the game to test out this Optifine snapshot. Go ahead and hit on play in here and then click that you understand the risk and then hit play again. As you can see, once the game is open, if we head over to options and we click on video settings, this whole menu has changed a little bit in here. As a matter of fact, we could click where it says performance and we could click on other and we could start changing things like if we were using Optifine. As you might see here, the shaders option is not supported just yet. So if you're installing Optifine for the shaders option, well, I'm sorry, this is just not supported right now. But if you go ahead and launch a world, you should definitely see a performance impact when using Optifine, even though I still think that Optifine might not be the best option when trying to improve performance anymore. There's so many other mods that will do much, much better than Optifine, but I know a lot of you still like to use Optifine. So that's why we made this video on how to install Optifine 1.21.1. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, bye-bye.